Welcome everyone to my YouTube channel, Smoothin again, and today I'm going to solve a usable step one question of the reproductive system block. A 36-year-old woman comes to the physician for an annual pelvic examination and pap smear. Her last pap smear was three years ago. She has been sexually active with multiple male partners and takes an oral contraceptive. She has smoked one pack of cigarettes daily for 10 years. Pelvic examination shows no abnormalities. A photo micrograph of cervical cells from the pap smear specimen is shown. Cells similar to the one indicated by the arrow are most likely to be seen in which of the following conditions? The correct answer here is the condylomata acuminata because... Coleocytes are pathognomic of infection with a human papilloma virus. Condylomata acuminata, like cervical dysplasia, are caused by an infection with human papilloma virus and can therefore present with coleocytes on histopathology. Condylomata acuminata are typically associated with human papilloma virus strains 6 and 11. Other manifestations of HPV infection include vulvular and vaginal intraepithelial neoplasia, as well as skin warts and blanter warts. As this patient's pap smear is consistent with a low grade squamous intraepithelial lesion, the next step in the management including testing for high risk HPV strains such as 16, 18, 31, and 33 via the BCR. Depending on the result, this should be followed by uh, col colboscopy, positive high risk HPV status, or repeated cytologic examination, negative high risk HPV status. And thank you for watching.